I'm a professional advocate. I'm a professional negotiator. I get hired by corporate America to negotiate on their behalf for the real estate they occupy for their business. I'm also called a tenant rep. Go to any city in the world, look at the office buildings. The overwhelming majority of people lease their space. People think of negotiating as being this thing where you're yelling back and forth at each other. That happens occasionally. But for the most part, what I do has to be fairly cooperative and it has to be fairly calm because we've got 50 deal points to go through. Because what happens in a negotiation, and when I say negotiation, I mean any kind of conflict, any place where people have to settle their differences, okay? When the stakes go up, emotions go up, different parts of your brain kick in. I'm in this position where, you know, the landlord wants the rent to go up, right? The tenant wants the rent to go down. Well, I live right here. It's not a complaint, but it can be kind of a stressful job. When you throw a few hundred thousand or a few million bucks on the table, everybody starts fighting to get their piece, it can be pretty instructive if you're paying attention. It's a great place to learn about how the world works and how people behave under pressure and a great place to learn about yourself. And so that's where I'm coming from tonight and that's why I sort of titled this thing, Things I, I Wish Someone Had Told Me in My Twenties, not that I'd have listened.